What is going on everybody? Today we're going back in the trails and we're going to cut through some of this thick stuff. Now I'm really gonna focus on going up and down some of these areas and grading out a new trail in there as long as I don't get stuck. Hopefully I don't. We're gonna be using the BX23 today to do that. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it's not too wet back there and we can get the BX back there. So this is the, the ditch that we're gonna be cutting in. And it goes all the way back here to the sugar shack. And so, again, the goal is to clean this stuff up. You see trees in the middle of this. This is old tile work um, that was in here. I, I, that's what I think. I think this could have possibly been a uh, logging road, too, as well. Uh, but this, whatever it is, there's trees growing in it. There's a lot of stuff that's down causing blocks and it's just overflowing into the rest of the property we have a tree stand here it's actually trying to trap some coons but and then back here is the sugar shack so my goal today is to cut a trail in back to here at least and try to get this property to dry out just a little bit because it's uh, pretty bad when it uh, snows and rains good habitat but it's time to start cleaning it up so So I apologize for any video change I'm on my phone now, but uh, got quite a bit done and just give you guys an update on what's going on. So the idea was to ditch out this old creek um, or tile ditch just wide enough for the tractor. So what I can do every year when it dries out, hopefully I can just simply drive the tractor in here, clean it out and be on my way. The ditch is only about a foot to a foot and a half deep. Uh, this is going to be a nice tile ditch for a lot of this area. I am going to come on this side of the property or this side of the ditch and grade this stuff back. So a lot of this water will pull here and then I'm going to make a runoff that goes down through here. I'd have to say this is about five feet, four and a half, five feet wide right now. And it goes all the way up to the tractor.
and stops right here. Now, I am going to, I wasn't gonna do this just because this is pretty low in itself, but if I'm here and I only got maybe 30 more feet to go, then I'll go to about right here. I uh, hope you guys liked the video. Um, I know there's probably not much uh, that happened in the video as far as the, the battery dying on the GoPro, but just give you an update um, on what's going on around here on the property. Uh, trying to get the ditching work done before hunting season, uh, probably at least two weeks before hunting season. So I got about a couple days left. Uh, and that is it. Hopefully things start to dry out. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the thumbs up if you like this video. Hit that bell icon if you want to be notified when we push new video. We got all kinds of stuff. I apologize. I haven't been putting out much video. I have uh, a couple um, videos that I need to put out with the rock sifter, the dirt sifter, which actually worked really good. An update on the pond uh, and a couple other tree stump videos that we were just cleaning up, land clearing videos here on the property. So until next time, I will see you guys later.